Saturday, October 5th, and now it really is the new moon. The sun and the moon at 11 degrees of Libra have completely conjunct. That means there's no visible moon because the sun and the moon are holding hands. They're covering each other. 11 degrees of Libra, activation point. Got that electrical energy. We always think of 11. It's kind of the 11-11 everyone talks about. They always wonder what it means. It's a rules Aquarius. It rules electricity. It's kind of a high charge. Nothing goes into 11. It's neither odd nor is it even. It's a stepping stone into the end of the cycle when we go to 13 in the Mayan calendar. So 11 is an activation point. But it's activating what during this weekend? It's activating our decision-making process. We talked about that yesterday. And it's a new moon is a time to go inside and revisit what up for this month. So take Saturday and Sunday. Ask yourself about your goals. It's early in October. It has an opportunity for us to be seeking relationships would be a theme for sure. How am I doing in my relationships? Is there anyone I need to update with? Is there any fresh conversations I need to have? But most of all, it's the relationship between you and you. It's what I said yesterday. You're your own authority. You're an expert on you. No one else gets you the way you do. But it takes courage to admit, I'm good at something. I'm really good at something, or I'm not good at something, or I really feel like I'm out of sorts with this person, or I really feel like I need to talk about this. That's the initiative energy that's being asked of us this weekend. It's not a comfortable time. The whole planet, as we know, is in the stressful dynamic. There's a grand cross in the heavens. There's also a T-square in the heavens. It releases in Taurus. So if we can slow down this weekend and do some deep internal looking, that's all that matters at the end of the day is what's going on between you and you. When you leave this planet, this is an honest Libra conversation, it will be the nature of the love first that you have between you and you, and then between you and your best lover, dog, partner, kid, whatever that love affair is. But in the end, it's you and you that have to do that internal quest of do I accept me just the way I am? And what if today in this weekend you made a new statement with this new moon to say, this month of October, I'm going to let myself do really healthy relationships. The whole planet would change.